Hi guys, this is Yasser Said. Today I'm going to um, try something different. It is going to be um, line art, not uh, the cartoon speed art that I usually do. So um, let's let's give it a shot. So I'll start with the uh, the usual square canvas. I'll use black as my um, color, base color. And um, I am going to use the studio pen as my main brush. And I will bring in this photograph. And then I'll start. So once this is done, I will use this uh, a new layer and that's going to be my my inking layer and i will try and make this the streamlining uh, at the max and bring the brush down because i'm doing line art so i will try to be as um, thin as possible so before that we're going to decrease uh, the opacity of this image and then I'm going to um, start and as usual um, I'll start with the nose So once this is done, um, this time I think what what the what the idea was to not paint, rather I'll just try and add, um, you know, um, highlights. Just it is probably is going to be um, a grayscale photograph. So. So now I'm going to go for the second layer of um, shade and I will go slightly lighter than the, the previous one. I'll go into another layer and go under the, the first layer of shadows. So now this is done, so I'm going to um, change the, uh, the brightness level just to, just to illustrate, just to give an idea of uh, where the, the shadows are. What I can also do is maybe add a bit of um, tint in the the highlights just to just to give it an artistic uh, feel so maybe i can just slightly go into um, apparently this layer doesn't have any effect i don't know what's going on but uh, So this looks fine and now I'm going to add 
um, something for the eyes. Uh, but before that, um, I wanted to give um, the jacket um, some color, and that color I'm going to use in the eyes just as an accent. So I'm going to use um, the shadows where the the shadows actually are and then let's use the the blue for the suit i'm gonna use a, a blue tint uh, for the eyes um, some some shadows for the eyes so that is going to be and then now um, for uh, for the inside of the eyes so I'm gonna use dark brown so yeah I I guess this this looks fine to me I just need to do a bit of tweaking to to some parts one of one more thing that I can try is the fact that I can select um, a part of his beard and then add um, a bit of um, the hair and the stubble and I'm going to use the stubble brush, increase the size, and then add, use black as the color. I still think the, the cleaner look looks much better than, uh, also I haven't finished this part So this is pretty much uh, done. I like it. Now I'm just gonna make this into a group. Um, readjust where I want to place this. And I want to personally, I want to add some kind of a background uh, to this. But again, I don't want a very um, uh, again strong I don't want to go for a for a strong background uh, it has to be something very simple um, so let me try a few brushes and then see uh, what can be done and I want to stay with the with the blue color so let's try abstract frankly I don't think there should be anything um, here so I'll just sign this and uh, I'll be done with it I, I don't think I should um, do too much to this today is the 18th So here you go guys, um, this was something that I tried for the first time, it was a little different from our, what I usually do, came out nice, I hope you enjoyed it, I will see you in the next video, until then, see ya.